Hi everybody, this is Andrew Gaffney with Retail Touchpoints. I'm here at NRF and I'm joined by Atul Jalan, who's the CEO of Manthan Systems. Thanks for joining me today. Pleasure is mine. So you're on a, a big idea session tomorrow and you're yes. going to be talking about the future of analytics, which is a big topic. Can you give our viewers a little preview of what you're going to be talking about? Sure. I think um, there are two significant changes which has happened to analytics over the last couple of years. Number one significant change to my mind is that information is, has become intelligent. And this in, intelligent information is no more than inert data. Right. That this info, intelligent information can arrive tailored to seekers' context and circumstance. I'll give you an example. We, do, we have a customer analytics portfolio where we, uh, one part of the product is what we call customer 360, okay. which helps you get a lay of the land on the customer, right. who she is, what she buys, when she buys, where she buys from, when she buys this, what else she buys, right. what stimuli of product attributes, price, promotion, events that she responds to. And we understand her life stage, her lifestyle. Basically, we try to understand her social behavior as well, glean through social media. Basically trying to get, achieve a segment of one. We all know, we all are unique in our own ways. Right. That the second product is about target one, which is basically helps you decide what kind of offer, promotion, product that you can offer to this customer. Okay. The second biggest change to my mind is that analytics has closed the loop in the sense that analytics has truly become actionable. Okay. You know, if the first phase of business computing you know, was automation of business processes, right. then to my mind, the last frontier in business computing, Andrew, uh, is, the, is that analytics have become the intelligent drivers of those automation system and therefore business processes. Okay, okay. Yeah. that's a great point. So it's interesting, I, I felt like in the earlier days of, of analytics, people were either talking about, you know, merchandising analytics in one bucket or customer analytics in a separate bucket. We were talking to Charming Charlie's CIO earlier, one of your customers. They're really trying to integrate that and take more of a holistic view. Is that what you're yes, seeing? Yes, absolutely. Uh, I see more in terms of the way people thought about laying a business automation system you have to think holistically about your analytical platform. So what I'm trying to say is you have to, you can't have a siloed view. Right. Not only within organization, that seamless uh, thing has to extend to your suppliers, your vendors as well. Okay. The whole dimension of online thing uh, in a good way has shaken up retail. So given them the opportunity to kind of rethink, reimagine, remodel their businesses, just a moment I mentioned about the whole non-linearity, channel of fulfillment, channel of demand, <laughs> how it gets fulfilled, is, is totally non-linear today. Okay, so where retailers and today retailers are looking at analytics to be able to drive that. Okay, their expectation from analytics today is that analytics will help them unearth associations which are counterintuitive and or subterranean. The second expectation that they have is analytics sometimes becomes good to have. You know, second is how, what kind of decisions could I based on, make on those intelligent information? Okay, okay. smarter decisions. Yes, and make me choose the optimal one by predicting the outcome of the decision that I would make. There are multiple ways that I could go, right? Which would be the optimal one for me by predicting the outcome? and more importantly, able to action that decision. Right. So that one of the key to the futures that you're going to talk about is making things more predictive and actionable? Absolutely. Right. Absolutely. Okay. Absolutely. Well, great. We appreciate you giving us a little sneak peek and we we'll look no. forward to the session. Thank you. Thanks. Have Thank a great you. day. Thanks, everybody.